If you're looking to buy small to team coins, go check out the FIFA shop.co.uk. All the links are down below in that description box. And use discount code of GC5 to get your 10% discount on all of your ores, guys. They're cheap, reliable, and you get your coins within 60 seconds. What's up guys, Juicy Messi here and welcome to a brand new video. Today we've got something a little bit special. Today we're encouraging a FIFA 16 alternate team concept ideas video. It's actually not made by myself. You may have actually seen this on Footer as well actually. A guy called Sue Art has actually made uh, some of the best concept ideas I've ever seen uh, for a FIFA game guys. We'll get into more detail about that in a second. So if you know 1,000 fires likes, that'd be absolutely awesome. In the comments below, not a new feature to do like added to alternate team in the future. And if you're new to my channel, click the subscribe button for daily FIFA content. So these designs were that freaking good that I had to contact the designer which is going to be called Sue Arts. His link will be in the description below to his Twitter. Go let him know how freaking awesome these are. You may have actually seen them on Foothead the other day as it was a top score by an absolute mile. So yeah, let's get straight into it. And uh, this is pretty sick. And the first slide of many is going to be the card show off. And as you can see, he's done the silver, gold, inform, man the match, international man the match, and legend cards. And honestly, I think they look pretty sick. He's actually added a new formation back on there as well. Uh, just something I don't think he will actually do. But I mean, in terms of design, they look pretty awesome. But that is going to be the very basic part of this video, guys. Next, we've actually got the menus and the layout. So first up, we've got the home screen as you can see it's got foot challenges a legend spotlight which is going to be pele i've got foot seasons active squad and your virtual pro which again virtual pro would be a new addition which is actually back from fifa 10 i do believe or maybe fifa 09 where your pro is actually in the game the second menu screen then is going to be the actual club screen as you can see the two main things that point out for me are going to be the change kit and badge and also the customized kit customized kit is something that's uh, heavily suggested on fifa videos and that'd be something that's pretty cool but again ea would probably have to limit it somewhat uh, otherwise people would probably run around with knobs on their kit but basically uh, that's going to be that screen next one is going to be to do with the uh, the play screen as you can see uh, it's very similar to this fee from me it's got the online divisions online tournaments play versus friends and uh, the simple stuff really but there is one addition to this screen as you can see it is the squad training section it says practice set pieces and uh, attacks and stuff like that and then on to the next screen then we have got the the pro section this is one that would be absolutely massive having your virtual pro back in ultimate team i mean it's got everything from those uh, stats is online arena customized pro save highlights again which is featured again uh, training matches and also your upgrades next up then we've got the squad screen this one's very very cool and as you can see it's got a new formation the 4-2-1-2-1 and also got the uh, the simple stuff on the right hand side including a fitness center and the final screen then is going to be the transfer market and there's uh, it's, again it's pretty standard but trade offers would be back but first up we can get a look at the detailed version of the squad screen so 4-2-1-2-1 and i mean it looks pretty sick again but as you see in the bottom right hand corner there's a lot of reading to do but i mean it's to do with new additions and stuff like that uh, but on the left hand side it's got a an actual physio which uh, i don't know what that actually do but i mean again it'd show you probably uh, how much fitness they'd gain and also so it's got the average total cost of which would be that, that that needs to be added pretty much also the how much you actually spent on it and the top it's got the rating and your actual record with that team individually and also in the bottom right it's actually got to do the chemistry and everything like that but the final screen of squads is going to be the my squads page and it looks a lot nicer i mean it's very uh, nice and smooth add shoes the squad uh, straight up so you don't have to uh, name it uh, specifically and uh, try and like go through all your teams to try and find it and uh, yeah the squad screen is pretty sick and now then we've got the collection screen this is something that used to actually be on fifa back in fifa 10 i do believe maybe FIFA 09 and they also have it on the Madden uh, NFL Ultimate Team that is going to be the collections as you can see it's actually got your players pretty much the my club screen but I mean in, in detail this would get a lot further and on the left hand side you've got the sort by info but also the filter by so you can actually see who scored the most goals in your club the most assists most clean sheets and everything like that and the next one is going to be your database everything that's actually on the game including legends and yeah every single player and the new place is actually added to this is actually going to be the legend Ronaldo, legend Thierry Henry. And uh, yeah, I mean, in my opinion, that they'd be two awesome legends to have on FIFA 16. And then we've got the foot history part, which is going to be pretty much FIFA generations. And this is what everyone seems to want. But as you can see, it's got Luis Suarez's FIFA 14 cards. I mean, it's got his green Iron Man, the match, his blue team this season, FIFA 13 team this season. And also got back to his FIFA 12 88 rated in form. And this next part is actually supposed to feature earlier on the video. That is going to be the collection part on the menu. As you see, bottom right hand corner, it's got the friends current collection. So you can view your other the friends have got in their clubs and finally then we've got three screens to show that don't actually come into any other category but first up we've got the transfer search as you see it's a lot more detailed than we've got now and something that would uh, like pretty much speed up building a team and everything like that and that's actually searching for an individual card i know you can do that via the concept squad right now but it should probably be on the actual transfer market now right instead so uh, as you can see it's got his normal card in forms man the matches i man the matches and a uh, another higher in form but basically that kind of stuff needs to be added now and then we've got a deeper look at the kit customization it's got the base layer the edit colors import images such as Nike and Puma uh, like sponsorships and then we've got add shapes which I'm not sure would be like I think it's kind of like uh, similar to Pez's one uh, move layers and also delete layers 
And finally, then we've got the actual player bio screen. It's when you click the right analog stick when you're in this squad menu. It's got his player record on the right hand side, including his goals to game and everything like that. And uh, it's a lot more detail. I mean, it shows his man of the matches, yellow cards, red cards, offsides, and also assists and total pass, which is pretty cool. And it's got his in game stats for fair on the left hand side, and also his player data. But it's got a real life picture, which makes it look pretty awesome. And that is going to sum up today's video, guys. If you enjoyed it, smash the like button. 1000 fire likes would be absolutely awesome. Remember, go follow Stu Arts in the description below on Twitter. Let me know how awesome these designs are. I mean, they're absolutely incredible, and so much time and effort has definitely been put into this. Uh, if you need to my channel, click the subscribe button for daily FIFA content. And yeah, guys, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you next time.